Have you ever wondered what happens to objects moving close to the speed of light? It's a mind-boggling concept that challenges our everyday assumptions. Albert Einstein's special theory of relativity reveals that such objects experience changes in length and time. This has been confirmed through numerous experiments. But there's one intriguing aspect of relativity we've never seen, until now. It's called the Terrell-Penrose effect, proposed by physicists James Terrell and Roger Penrose in 1959. They suggested that fast-moving objects should appear rotated. However, no one has ever demonstrated this effect, until a recent collaboration between TU Wien and the University of Vienna. For the first time, researchers recreated the Terrell-Penrose effect using laser pulses and precision cameras. They achieved this at a speed equivalent to just 2 meters per second. Their breakthrough has been published in Communications Physics. Imagine a rocket flying past us at 90% the speed of light. To us, it would appear 2.3 times shorter than its actual length, a phenomenon known as relativistic length contraction. Capturing this effect in a photograph isn't straightforward. Light from different parts of the rocket doesn't reach the camera at the same time. If we take a picture as the rocket zooms by, the light from its front corner travels a shorter distance than the light from its back corner. This leads to fascinating optical illusions. Now, picture a cube racing through space. The side facing us and the side facing away are at different distances. If photons from both sides reach our eyes simultaneously, the light from the back must have been emitted earlier when the cube was in a different position. This creates the illusion that the cube is rotated, as predicted by Terrell and Penrose. Even super-fast cars don't reach speeds that reveal the effect. However, in the case of a rocket moving close to light speed, the phenomenon would be dramatic. Currently, we can't accelerate rockets to observe this in action. Yet, the team at TU Wien found an innovative solution. By using laser pulses in a high-speed camera, they simulating conditions of the Terrell-Penrose effect in a lab environment. They moved a cube and a sphere around while recording the reflections from various points at different moments. By cleverly timing the laser emissions, they created an effect similar to a speed of just 2 meters per second. What's fascinating is how they merged these snapshots into short video clips, clearly illustrating the Terrell-Penrose effect. The twisted cube appeared as predicted, while the sphere remained unchanged. Surprisingly, the visual effects create a unique artistic perspective along with the scientific demonstration. Originally sparked by artist Anar de Dios Rodriguez, this project has deepened our understanding of the elusive realm of relativity.